Instagram model Lauren Goodman narrowly escaped jail today after she admitted wrongly claiming more than £21,000 in benefits. Goodman, 28, who had other forms of income, claimed housing benefit and income support after providing misleading financial details. The sister of Ex on the Beach star Chloe Goodman who supported her in court wept in the dock as she was told the custodial threshold for the crimes had been passed and she could go to jail. But she was spared a prison sentence after the judge heard she had suffered from depression and was genuinely remorseful, having paid back the figure in full ahead of her appearance. The judge handed Lauren a seven-month jail sentence suspended for two years and ordered her to carry out 200 hours of unpaid work as well as pay £670 costs. Hove Crown Court was told the 28-year-old, who describes herself as a social media influencer, had lied when she had filled in application forms for income support and housing benefit, She claimed a total of £21,007.76 and did not tell that the Department for Work and Pension she had other income from an insurance policy, that she had several different bank accounts, and that she was a joint mortgagee with her mother on a house in Portslade, Brighton. The court heard she wrongly claimed benefits between December 2013 to December 2016. Piers Power, prosecuting, said that when she was interviewed in February 2017 she claimed the bank accounts belonged to her mother and she had no access to them, said an ISA containing a large sum of money belonged to her father and told them she had no interest in the property in Portslade. Investigators found an undeclared bank account and discovered payments for a ski holiday in the upmarket French resort of Les Arcs. The court heard Goodman also ran a fashion firm, 19, but she told investigators it no longer existed. It is since East Trading. Goodman pleaded guilty to seven offenses relating to the benefits fraud at an earlier hearing and arrived at Hove Crown Court in a white Mercedes SUV with her sister Chloe, 29, for sentencing today. Sally Mertens, defending, said Goodman was mortified by her own conduct which had happened at a time when she was suffering from depression. She said, there is an ongoing problem with depression which can be linked to a lie being told and an inability to face up to thing and an inability to face the music as far as behaving responsibly. She is very, very sorry for her conduct. She has shown genuine remorse, and it is not simply a tick box exercise. She has lost her good character. For someone who is well-educated and comes from a family that has had a lot of opportunities, the loss of that good character is significant. The court also heard Goodman was on a phased return to work at HSBC and that they had stood by her during this case. Judge David Rennie handed Goodman a seven-month jail sentence suspended for two years and warned her that any future breach in the law would undoubtedly land her behind bars. He said, this did go on for some while but essentially it was out of character. I accept it is not who you are. You made some catastrophically bad decisions, but that does not excuse what essentially was stealing. The court heard Goodman had paid back the entire £21,007.76 prior to today's hearing. 
However, Judge Rennie told her she could not buy herself out of trouble, but the move showed she was willing to accept the gravity of her wrongdoing. Outside court, Goodman, who was accompanied by her sister Chloe, refused comment. Read more showbiz editors' picks.